really put out in the first half. And I loved it. That's that's our guy. We, he's, been, he's been waiting on his name to get called. And he got called this year. I told him to be, I kept telling him to be ready and be ready. And he went in there and had like two or three offensive rebounds. Maybe had like five rebounds. And some key free throws. I mean, he played really good. I'm proud of him. Michigan State's going to be hungry for you guys. Is, it, is this about matching their intensity tomorrow? Or? No, we don't do that. We play our game. We're not, we're not going to play another person's game. we got to stick to our game plan. Don't let them. Like Coach said today, he, I love what he said, actually. He said, um, don't let them implement their game plan. We want to implement ours. So we got to kick theirs out the way so we put our game plan in. That's, that's the whole. He's probably, he'll probably use that tomorrow in our game plan, too. Talk a little bit about what the difference between last Nebraska game and this one. Uh, last Nebraska, for one, the crowd was super loud in Nebraska. Unbelievable. Uh, but now it's just like like we were talking about switching earlier. It's, it's a major difference when the guru, our coach, puts in these sets. So we got sets to switch, so we had a little point guard on Mo, and they're going to have to double off him, and it just leaves up wide open shots. Mo makes a great play. Talk about how Z responded when he had a bigger guy on him, too, today. Yeah, Z. I mean, he's a, he's a pit bull. I mean, you not you can't back him down. I tried to back him down this summer because I didn't, I didn't know much about him. I just knew he was really good. Tried to try to post up for him. No way. That dude is low to the ground. You can't post him up. You just gotta give him a follow. You. <laughs> but no, he's he's gritty and he he has he's our energy guy. When he has energy, the whole team has energy. After how yesterday went, you know, getting a win like this so big and, you know, guys hitting your shots doing well, I mean, how much confidence does that give you now moving forward in, into the state game? Big, big difference coming from yesterday. We was, like, only hit our, he hit our only threes yesterday. Coming today, probably about three or four people hit threes today. It's just, it carry, it's going to carry out momentum to the game tomorrow. I think, I think our shot's going to be great tomorrow. How confident are you that Jordan's going to be able to pop out of his slump here? He'll pop out of his slump sometime, you know. He's, 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 a, he's a natural scorer. Obviously, he's gonna get out of the slump tomorrow, but he's a, he's a natural scorer, a great guy. He has all the confidence in the world, so I'm, I'm expecting him to get out of his, his slump. <laughs> tomorrow, you uh, you match up against Xavier Tillman. You played A U with yeah, yeah. Uh, and beat in uh, Mr. Basketball last year. Is there any sort of extra personal side to, to that? No way. That's my guy. I love Xavier, man. We we go. I mean, we would played our 16U, but we go way back. I remember he was playing for like Grand Prix Storm, so it's just great. I want him to have a great game, like he wants me to have a great game. Um, it's a uh, big seven foot monster. He's he's nice. He he's starting to rebound a lot better. He's moving his feet a lot better than he was. Like there was one where he had uh, he was messed up with a guard. He was moving his feet. I was like, okay, I like that. Made made the guard pass the ball because he had nothing to do with it. He didn't know. You can move his feet like that. The sleep's been a great impact on the bench.